exclusive Nikki Haley trails DeSantis New Hampshire as Trump maintains lead the USA Today Boston. Globe Suffolk poll says a fluid race. Nearly 410 likely Republican primary voters the Granite State could still change their minds. Donald Trump maintains a formidable lead in the influential New Hampshire primary. According to an exclusive poll. But a new challenger is emerging as his top challenger their former UN ambassador Nikki Haley. A USA Today Boston Globe University of Suffolk poll of voters likely to participate in the nation's first Republican primary found Trump at 49 and Haley at 19. While that 30 percentage point lead was daunting, it put him ahead of Florida Gov. Ron DeSantis, who has lost his once dominant position as Trump's dominant alternative. DeSantis' vote share fell to 10 in the poll. I disagree with Nikki 100. From what I've followed so far, shush is closest to what I want to see in the president, said David Paquette, 72, a retired engineer from Atkinson, NH who was among survey participants. As a political independent, he likes DeSantis' record in Florida and is considering that. Two. He really has a lot of great programs that he implements. The poll 500 likely Republican primary. Voters. Conducted by landline and cell phone Thursday through Monday. Has a margin of error plus or minus 4.4 points. Independents allowed to vote in the New Hampshire primary made up 40 of the sample. 60% were Republicans. These voters are almost evenly split on whether it's most important for Republicans to nominate candidate who reflects their priorities and values, or nominate a candidate who can defeat President Joe Biden's bid for second term. Despite Trump's strong stance, there were some signs that the race was fluid. Survey respondents were split. 48 to 44. When asked whether Trump's candidacy was inevitable or whether another candidate could win the GOP nomination, almost 4 in 10, or 39, said they might change their mind before the primary. However, Trump's supporters were more loyal than supporters of other candidates. An overwhelming majority of 84% said their decision was ready to support him. Only 15 said they would switch to someone else. I trusted Trump the last time he was there. He did good for us and I don't care what anyone else says. Said Joyce Briand. 62. A registered Republican from Newport. N.H. Who supports him? Briand. A retired licensed nursing assistant. Added Trump can do some bad things. Everyone does. I don't like some of the things he says. He should just keep his mouth shut sometimes. But when he says H is going to do something, he does it. Former New Jersey Governor Chris Christie was at 6. Tech entrepreneur Vivek Ramaswamy and South Carolina Senator Tim Scott received 4 while former Vice President Mike Pence and North Dakota Governor Doug Burgum received one. Haley is buoyed by her strong performance in the two Republican debates so far. In the six months before the first debate, 